Dear great folks, I'm on the banks of the River Boyne. I was here two days ago for sunrise. I made a video, but at the time I didn't realize I had a big spot in the, on my nose the size of Gibraltar, so there's no way I was putting that video out. I'm back this evening, beautiful calm evening. The tide is on its way in and I'm hoping to capture some of the beacons that litter, I'm not litter, to guide the ships down the river here and isolate them against the, the sky and the water. Um, no idea if it's going to work, but we'll see. Beautiful light zone, really peaceful. So I'm going to try and get set up, try and get a shot, and we'll see what happens. And fingers crossed it does. Okay, so I think I got my first composition. I got this, the first beacon right in the middle, and these other ones fanning out to the left and the right. I'm going to try a long exposure. Uh, I'm already thinking it's going to be like a 4x5 crop because I want to exclude the bank of rocks over here and there's almost too much space over here. So I'll try one or two exposures here, a bit F8, F11, and we'll see what happens. A load of people walking around, so I need to be careful uh, they don't get into the shot. Let's see how it works out. Okay, so I've got a composition I think I'm happy with. There's a gorgeous silver blue tone on the water at the moment. And these beacons, they're separated nicely. There's no overlap between them. This has got real potential. Nice bit of light in the sky. Go and take this image. I've got the 7200 on. I've pre-focused on the first beacon here. An aperture F8, and I'm going to try one at F11. And I've got the little stopper on just to bring that shutter speed down to about seven or eight seconds. Uh, this looks quite interesting. Let's see how that works. 